As soon as you master the short instruction, you can start testing strategies on basic level. To understand program elaborately, you should go further and watch other more in-depth video tutorials. Please download the program here at www.forextester.com forward slash download. Project creating. Click on the new project button. Enter any project name and then click next. Enable checkbox of needed currency pair or pairs and then click next. Click the create button. Wait until the data is prepared. Maximize the chart. Start testing. Click start test and the program will start drawing candles for chosen currency pair. Click pause to stop test. Please use drop down menu to adjust time frame. You can change tick package size by clicking appropriate drop down menu. If your current time frame is H1 and tick package size is M5 program, should change price 12 times on current bar before starting new one. To go back to test, please click pause again. You can change testing speed by moving runner to the left to slow down and to the right to speed up bar movement. Click the space button on the toolbar or the step forward by single bar button on the keyboard. Click the backspace button on the keyboard or the step back by single bar button on the toolbar. Placing pending orders. To place a pending order, use the place new pending order button or the F3 button on your keyboard. Click once on drawdown menu and choose order type. Please note that limit orders are working on the price rebound from entered value, while stop orders for price breakout of this value. For example, if you expect price to go higher than current price to some point and continue to go down in this case, you should set sell limit order. If you expect price gets some point below current price and keep going down, in this case, you should open sell stop on name point. Click on drop down menu once and choose lot size. Choose the price you want order to be opened with. Using dropper, click once dropper icon. After, please click on chart when you want to set pending order opening price. Enter stop loss value. Enter take profit value. Click place order button. Closing pending orders. Unclick pause button and wait till price will close on stop loss or take profit. Or move using space button on the keyboard. To close order manually, click twice on the required orders line. In pending orders tab, click delete order button. Placing market orders. Navigate to orders, new market order, menu. Or click on place new market order button on the toolbar. Set stop loss value using dropper. Set take profit value. Click the buy button. Please note that to sell orders stop loss will always be situated above and take profit below the entry level. For buy orders, stop orders placement will be opposite. Stop loss below and take profit above the entry level. Closing market orders. Unclick pause button and wait till price will close on stop loss or take profit or move using space button on the keyboard. To close order manually, click twice on the required orders line. In market orders tab, click close position button. Adding indicators and graphic tools. If your trading system implies using of indicators, you can always add it in Insert Add Indicator menu. To add such graphical tools as horizontal and vertical lines, text labels, Fibonacci tools, trend lines, and many other important tools of technical analysis, you can use Insert menu or choose Required Instrument on the toolbar. To analyze backtesting results, switch from Symbols to Statistics tab in Window. That is in the upper left corner of the screen. Here you can find all required statistic information about your strategy.